No spacecraft has ever come so close to our nearest star. But now NASA is on a mission to shed light on the sun. Why are we doing such a daring mission? We know a lot about the sun. We, it's, it's just over there. We see it every day. But the sun is full of mysteries. One of those mysteries is the sun's outer rim, which is hundreds of times hotter than its surface. The unmanned Parker Solar Probe will also study the sun's winds, gas that races away from the sun at more than 1,600,000 kilometers per hour. And this space weather um, has direct influence not always positive on our technology in space, our spacecraft can disrupt our communications and creates a hazardous environment for astronauts. And in the most extreme case of these space weather events, it can actually uh, affect our power grids here on the Earth. But a mission to the ball of fire is no easy task. The solar probe would require 55 times more launch energy than a voyage to Mars, and it'll travel faster than any human-made object in history, fast enough to fly from the US to Japan in less than a minute. An impressive feat for a spacecraft no larger than a car. The first thing we will do when we get on orbit is encounter the planet Venus. We use Venus to give us a gravity assist. We don't take energy from the planet, we give it generously. And we actually slow down just a little bit, and that allows us to uh, shrink our orbit and go closer to the sun than anything has been before. The probe will scan the sun's atmosphere from within 8 million kilometers of its surface. Scientists say the probe's carbon heat shield should prevent it from melting. It'll send back results for up to seven years before it finally succumbs to the sun's blistering heat and winds. Regan Nevins, TRT World.